You're watching a Sony Vegas compilation. What's up guys, my name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new video. And in this video, I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to create this awesome spinning effect. So that is a really, really cool transition. I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to recreate that in Vegas Pro 15. So I would say, make sure to smash that like button down below. And I would say, let's get started. <laughs> Alright guys, so as you can see right now, we are in Vegas Pro 15 and right here I'm going to show you guys how to make that awesome spin transition. So, what we're going to do first of all is we're going to drag in our clip, that's very important. What I'm going to do then is I'm going to add in some nice color corrections. So I'm going to go to the FX tab as you can see on the right. Then I'm going to just go ahead and add in a nice turquoise glare with letterbox or you can choose other templates, that's just totally up to you. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to disable the cookie cutter because I don't need those black bars. What you want to do then next is you want to go ahead and make sure to cut right here. Perfect. Like this, but wait like maybe two seconds. Then we're going to go to the next take and we're going to delete the middle part. Then what we're going to do guys is really, really simple. We're going to go ahead and cut right here and on the first clip we're going to go to the Ivan Pan Crop. Then what we're going to do is we're going to place our keyframe at the very end of the clip and we're going to turn this one just one full circle as you can see like this. This is what it looks like. So it's turning like 360 degrees. So that looks really cool. So what we're going to do then is we're going to go ahead and make sure to place this guy over it so we have a crossfade so it moves into the other clip. So if I play back this video, this is what it looks like right now. Awesome spinning effect. So that is a really effect. So that is a real effect. So that is a really, really cool transition. I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to recreate that in Vegas Pro 15. So I would say, make sure to smash that like button down below. And I would say, let's get started. Okay, so that one looks really, really cool as you can see. Effect. So that is a real effect. Effect. So that is a real effect. So that effect. So that is a really, really effect. So that is a really, really Okay guys, so this is a very cool transition and you can use this basically anywhere and when I was when I was doing research on this topic, I've seen a lot of people doing this transition with the sapphire effect. Now, as you can see on the on the left, I have the sapphire effect if I go ahead and show you guys this. As you can see if I go to transitions, this s underscore and then you have the title of the of the trans, of the of the effect and the transition. This is basically the sapphire effect. I just found this one on YouTube. You can go ahead and look for a link that will have the download link available to download the sapphire effect because i think it is not for free so i cannot so i cannot make a tutorial about how to crack it obviously but i'm pretty sure that you will find the link to how to get the sapphire effect for free and i've seen a lot of people using uh this sapphire plugin for this but i thought like why would why would we even make it complicated and go ahead and download external plugins if you can do this with the event pan crop like this spinning effect so that is really really cool so that's how amazing it is guys this is how you create a nice spinning transition so that's it for this video i know this is a really really short tutorial but i just wanted to show you guys this so that's it thank you for the continued support i will see you guys tomorrow with a brand new vegas pro 15 tutorial as always and i will see you guys tomorrow What's up guys, my name is Alex and welcome back to this new tutorial and in this video I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to recreate an awesome glitz transition So I'm gonna show you guys in just a second what I mean with that So make sure to smash that like button down below already and I would say let's begin with the video A really cool transition so I would say let's get into Vegas and let's get started yeah, yeah. all right folks as you can see right now we are in Vegas Pro 15 and I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to create that awesome transition so I would say make sure to smash the like button down below already and I would say let's get started so, okay so the first thing that we're gonna do guys is we're gonna drag in 
uh, the clip that we're gonna make the transition on. So we're gonna drag in two different clips because it, it is a transition onto a second clip. So it's obvious that we're gonna drag in two clips. So what I'm going to do is I'm gonna drag in my first intro at first. Okay, so this is the first clip as you can see. This is just the intro of the video. What's up guys, my name is Alex and welcome back to this new tutorial. And in this Okay, so what we're gonna do then is we're gonna also drag in the second clip. Okay, so this is the clip in the car as you can see. So I'm gonna go ahead and just go right here at the end with the video. So I'm gonna cut it right here, press S, delete it. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put this guy onto each other and this is what it looks like so far. Let's begin with the video. And then as you can see, it goes to the other clip. So we're, what we're gonna do on that transition, we're gonna add in a nice glitch effect with a sound effect. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to YouTube for a second. And if you search for glitch transition, as you can see, we have a lot of transitions we can choose from, a lot of tutorials as well. So as you can see, this one looks very cool. Uh, if I go mouse over, uh, this is basically a very cool transition, as you can see. I'll show you guys a little preview of it. So if I go ahead and click on it, as you can see, this is a very nice glitch transition. So we're going to download that one to our computer and then we're going to go back to Vegas. Okay, so now that we dragged in the effects, this one, what we're going to do is we're going to create a new video track and we're going to go ahead and delete the audio because we are going to use separate audio. So what we're going to do then is we're going to place this on top of the transition. And what we're going to do is if I play this video back, as you can see, you won't see anything of the clip. So we're going to go ahead and go to the compositing mode, put that one to screen. And as you can see, we can now look through it. So as you can see, that's a really cool effect. But if you want to have it like shorter, obviously you can just drag it shorter and just place it on there. As you can see, that one looks really cool. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the same, we're gonna go on YouTube, just type in uh, glitch transition and we're gonna drag in a nice audio clip of a glitch sound effect. And as you can see, we have a lot of sound effects to choose from. So that one looks, sounds really cool. We're gonna just press S, delete this part right here, press S. We're gonna put it underneath our, our transition and this is what it looks like. The video. As you can see, that one looks really cool and that's how to do it. That's how I also created my intro. I just uh, dragged in different types of uh, glitch sound effects, different types of glitch, um, like visuals, like the real, like a video, just different, there are a thousand like different clips on YouTube, all kinds of transitions. So that's how to do it guys. This is how you create an awesome glitch transition. And obviously, like I said, there are tons and tons of other options you can choose from, but this is just one I found on YouTube in the, in the first few results I got. So that's how simple it is, guys. This is how you create the transition. I want to thank guys for watching. Thank you for the continued support. And I will see you guys tomorrow with the last video. And I'll see you guys tomorrow with a brand new tutorial, as always, on the channel. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. What's up, guys? My name is Alex. Welcome back to a brand new tutorial. And in this video, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to create those awesome black flashes you see at the drops of music videos, anything like that. So make sure to smash the like button down below already. And I would say, let's get started with the video. Hey folks, as you can see right now, we are in Vegas Pro and I'm going to show you guys exactly how to create those black flashes on this NCS video because this one has a really nice drop and you can actually apply this on anything. You can apply this on your own music videos, on everything else you can imagine. So it's going to be a really, really cool technique and a really smart technique and also a very obvious one because we're not going to, you know, do anything with external plugins. We're going to just do some cutting and... Uh, lowering the opacity. So that's what we're gonna do today. So I'm gonna show you guys exactly how to do that. So as you can see, first of all, to get started, uh, you need a uh, video that we're gonna just use this effect on. So then what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and look for the drop. Okay, so here's the drop, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and make those flashes appear when she says, take it easy. Right here. 
right here it starts. Okay, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and apply this effect on this entire part. So what we're gonna do then, cut right here, press S, and what we're gonna do is we're gonna play this back, and we're gonna cut, um, and we're gonna press S on the beat of the song, we're gonna time it, so then it will create awesome cuts, and then we can create those black flashes. So I'm gonna go ahead and play, uh, play this back, and I'm gonna cut exactly on uh, the beat. There we go. So as you can see, this is where we've cut it. So then what we're gonna do is we're gonna zoom in and every cut that we made right here, we're gonna split them one, uh, split those into once more. So as you can see, what we're gonna do is pretty simple, is we're gonna just go ahead and click right here, because if we go ahead and mute every single track, you know, it, it has to be go up and down. It has to opacity up, opacity down, opacity up, opacity down. If we play it back, this is what it looks like. As you can see, that's not, you know, fast enough. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna split up every single part that we cut it in two. So we're gonna start off with this one, opacity down, cut away, cut it to the next one, opacity up, opacity down, I go ahead and cut to the next one, opacity up, opacity up, opacity down, like so, right here, opacity up, opacity down, right here again, opacity up, opacity down, and we're gonna do that for the whole part. So what we've done doing that, splitting every single clip up in two, and then go ahead and click on the clip. Opacity 100, opacity 0, opacity 100, opacity 0, uh, 100, 0, 0. So it has to be the screen black, the circle black, the circle black. And if we play it back, this is what it looks like. Take it easy. And that's how to do it guys. This is how you create those awesome flashes. I want to thank you guys for watching. Thank you for the continued support. That is how simple it is and I will see you guys uh, tomorrow in the last video of this week and I'll be back on Monday with a brand new tutorial. So that's it. Thank you guys for the support and I want to mention that the Vegas Pro 15 giveaway is still open until November 18. So make sure to check out the description. There's a link to the giveaway and then you can actually win a copy, a hard, co a physical copy that I will ship to you if you win. Uh, of this actual program, $600, that's a lot of giveaway value, uh, like, let's put it that way. That's it, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Just Alex Halford.